Hey guys, it's Ollie B here, hope you're going well. Um, hey, I just wanna tell you, like, one of the best things you can do in this time in life is to get into God's presence. And something that I do most days is I put on my TV and I just play some worship um, videos from YouTube. I, I play Sons of Korah a lot. Um, I really love their music. They sing the Psalms out of the Bible. Um, yeah, so I just sort of like lean into God and just start um, praising Him, singing to Him, uh, just worshiping Him in a, a posture of um, thankfulness and praise. Uh, okay, so why do I do this? If everything I do, there's a, there's a purpose behind what I do, and I explain, and this is really, really important. The purpose behind this is that um, I want to start my day uh, with God, uh, and I want to start the day with His power. Uh, because I find like if I'm not in the power of God, I just find life is just like depressing and hard. <laughs> and I don't want that. I want to be joyful. I want to be happy. Uh, and if you look at like how God designed um, us in the beginning, we walked with God uh, in a garden in intimately like a rainforest. And so God's desire is for mankind to, to be in his presence and uh, Jude 18 says that, you know, now to him who is able to keep you, um, who is able to keep you from stumbling and to present you holy and blameless in the presence of God. So what is what is Jesus doing? He is taking us into the very presence of God. Um, and this is a this is the most beautiful thing that the gospel, that the cross allows us to do. We've gone from being an enemy of God uh, rebellious sinners to being saved by uh, Jesus' death on a cross. And that, that, that uh, cross gives us a pathway into God because Jesus has stood in the gap for where we fall short. None of us, all of us sin and fall short and God gets this uh, and it's not good. But um, Jesus has made a way for us to come into the presence, into the very being of God. And this is incredible. So we're no longer separated. So Back to what I was saying, I um, start my day uh, as a bit of a, uh, you know, early morning ritual. I will just open, uh, sorry, I will turn on my TV, play some YouTube videos, and I just start worshipping like this. Yeah, that's a beautiful promise in Psalm 84 that God will not withhold any good thing. He wants to give us good things. He's a good, good father. He's a generous and gentle dad. And... That's hard for a lot of guys to get their heads around because, you know, we often see God as, you know, distant or a harsh father and that couldn't be further from the truth. So I hope this has been a blessing to you. <laughs> Bit of KFC in there. That wasn't meant to be in the video, but it's kind of funny. Um, yeah, love me some KFC.